Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I'm trying to keep up with my one video once a month. <laughs> I try. So I'm trying to plan ahead and figure out what the next uh, what next month's content can be. Oh gosh, my eyelash is really driving me crazy. Sorry. Uh, but still busy at work. Things are still, you know, amped up in different places. The show house is about to begin, so I'm really excited about that. Uh, so the designers have done a great job with it. If you live here in Indiana or Indianapolis, if you're local, I think you should go to the show house. And I will provide a link below if you want to purchase a ticket. And then you can put uh, my name in there, Mrs. Shockley, and I can get credit for that. So I'll th I think I'll go ahead and put a link for that below. But in today's video, I'm going to be sharing some of my Facebook Marketplace finds. Um... I've been really finding some awesome pieces on Facebook Marketplace. Once you hone in what you're looking for and what you need, it gets a little easier doing the search, the searches um, on the Facebook Marketplace. So um, I'm going to go ahead and cut to that video here very shortly. But a new little project that I'm working on here in my home. So if you follow me on Instagram and my LTK then you will see that um, I have been buying lots of organizational pieces with Amazon. So I'm trying to get my life in order. You know, when I turned, I thought about this recently. When, you know, I've been married 20 years. We had our 20 year anniversary in February. And, you know, now that, you know, the kids, well, the, ki the, bo the, the boys have moved out, my stepsons, and, you know, Lauren's in college. Now these last... To, I would say the last two years of my life, I've been able to step back and think and get out of this cloud of just being a mom and working and just trying to get by and survive. Now I've been able to step back and think, okay, what do I really want to do with my life and how do I want to live now that my daughter is practically a young woman? I mean, she's 19 and it's, it's a different, it's, being an empty nester and stepping into this different chapter of my life has just forced me to pull back and go, you know what? Life is so short. I think COVID taught us that. And I really want to live as beautifully as I can. Sorry, the video got cut short. I thought someone was at my door. It kind of creeped me out a little bit. So I went and checked and it's fine. It's just the wind is really windy here. But as I was saying, um, you know, being in this different chapter has forced me to really think about how I want to live my life and... I just, there's so many things I want to do. There's so many ways I want to decorate my home. There's so many things I have going on in my mind right now. There's a lot of things going on and still trying to work, you know, keep track of Lauren, you know, guide her now that she, I can't even make doctor's appointments for her anymore. It's, it's so different and bizarre right now being in a stage of life where you have now become a spectator somewhat in your kid's life. It's so, it's so weird. It's so weird because... Um, I'm so used to taking the reins and taking care of things that she needs help with or things that needs to get that need to get done. And I can't, when I called to try to make her a doctor's appointment, they were like, no, you can't do that, you know, because of HIPAA and all this other stuff. And I went, I can't make her a doctor's appointment kind of hit you right here. It's like, oh dear, it's happening. So, you know, so just being in this different chapter in life and trying to figure out, you know, what, how I want to live and what I want to do and what my goals are, because I'm, you know, heading into my mid forties and life is going by so quickly. I ran into someone that I work with at a law firm several years back. And what she said to me, she goes, you know, the last time I saw you, you were pregnant. And then she paused and she said, how old is that baby? <laughs> and I said, she's 19. And she goes, we've been gone from that firm that long. And it's like, yeah, it's been that long. So just stepping back and thinking how time is just going and trying to take advantage of things and trying to live your life to the fullest. We've recently lost someone to cancer. There's a couple of other people I know who are battling cancer. There's so many things going on in people's lives. And each day that I wake up, I'm just thinking, okay, I want to live my life the best way I can. I really do. And try to eliminate drama and just do the best that I can. Because as I just said, Life is so short. It really is. And even if someone is not on board with how you decorate your home, and sometimes I see these horrible, hideous comments that people make to other influencers, and I, I don't get it for the life of me. I think 
Social media has just created this world where everyone feels like they have to say something. And it's like, no, you don't. If you don't like what someone's doing, go away, unfollow. It's that simple. And it amazes me some of the things I see that people comment. It's like, are you kidding me? You have energy like that to comment? And I'm get, I'm sorry, I'm getting on my little rant here. <laughs> but um, this, that's just where I am right now. It's like, I don't, I'm not making time for that. Go away. <laughs> go away so anyway um but get to get back on track one of the special projects that i've been working on is organization and decor and i have just i've been inspired by the show house recently so i've been looking for vintage plates and i think i'm going to start putting them on this wall here where the um where the scene this chinoiserie a piece of art is I think I want to do vintage plates so this is the one of the ones I found this was at Midland's antique store it's gorgeous it's I think it's actually it's Johnson Brothers made in England so here's the back of it but it it's beautiful it's absolutely beautiful I think I paid like $40 for it so I've got some plate hangers in my cart with Amazon this one I found with Poshmark nine dollars and i think it's hand painted and it's I'm not sure what this is but it's gorgeous and i'm thinking about adding that to, next to the platter as well i found this yesterday for 99 cents at the goodwill and it's like the toile so gorgeous so i'm actually going to the goodwill today to look for a couple of other things um and uh, I'll, I'll do some filming and share some things later on, maybe in the next month or two about what I find, because I'm not done yet looking for plates. So we'll see what I end up doing and how it looks. And, you know, I'll, of course, I'll be sure to, you know, share it on the blog and share it on here on um, YouTube. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the Facebook finds. So here we are with Marketplace find number one. This couch I purchased last year. I'm having a brain fog right now. It's like, what? yes, it was last year. I think in summer or spring, I saw it on Facebook Marketplace, um, and I just thought it was gorgeous. So I don't know the name of the couch. I don't know much about it. There was a tag underneath it, and now I can't remember the name of it. But it was gorgeous. She originally wanted, I think, five hundred, which honestly still isn't that bad. <laughs> And then um, I waited a little bit longer and turns out she was going to be moving soon. So when I reached out to her, she was packing up and moving the next day. And so we were able to negotiate a price for much less. So I think we paid like 300 for it, which is honest, honestly astonishing because it's well made. It's a... It's like a yellowish color. I know it looks cream in the video and on photos, but it's a yellowish color, but I still do love it. I love the wood trim on the couch. It's it's a solid piece. It's solid. There was no damage to it whatsoever. I do have to replace the cushions because when you sit down, it kind of falls and you, you kind of feel like you're falling into the couch. The couch cushions are really old. I think she got it like in 2008, 2009. So it's already a couple of years old, but I just love it. I love it. It's, it's a great solid piece. There's four feet at the bottom of it. And it's really, really beautiful. So I've got a new couch cushion coming from Amazon and I'll insert that. By the time I post this video, the couch cushion may already be in it and it may work, but I've ordered one couch cushion just to see if it's the right size and if it'll fit. So uh, we'll see how that goes. The second Facebook marketplace place purchase that I want to share are my two white chairs. These are like the symbol of a home for elegance. They're a part of my logo, the branding. I love these white chairs. I got these, oh man, probably during the pandemic. So I probably got them 2021, 2022. I pay like 150 for both these chairs. Now, these chairs did have a little bit of stain. They had a few stains on them, but not too many like this. I cannot get out. I've tried everything, but 
from a distance, you can't see it. So it actually works out great. I absolutely love these chairs and <laughs> I'm still thinking about reupholstering them, but it might be a while because it's going to be so expensive for me to do that. And the two blue and white pillows on here, I got those when I was 19. I bought these pillows when I was 19 years old. I'll never forget it. It was my first apartment and they were so expensive to me back then. Back then they were $19 each, which that was a lot of money to me back then because I was on such a tight budget. But I found them at TJ Maxx. And when I saw them, I thought, oh gosh, I love those. And I can hear <laughs> my mom and family saying, those are old lady pillows. But here they are, what, 20 years later, I still have them. I mean, they're still in fantastic shape and they're timeless. They have a bit of a chinoise reprint. And I haven't seen anything like these at Home Goods <laughs> since then. So those are great. And I love my chairs. I love my couch. I can't believe I got both pieces for what, under 500, just about. So these are my two favorite um, Facebook finds, Facebook Marketplace finds. The end tables, I'm going to change those. Um, so I'm on the hunt for new end tables. I got these from a friend who passed away a couple of years ago and I'm still having a hard time parting with them, but it's time because I really want something different. It's something that flows a little bit better with um, my sitting room. This piece here is not a Facebook Marketplace find, but I have to share it because I haven't videoed it at all. It is a tufted stool that I picked up from an antique store and it was a hideous brown color. I'll link the blog, po the blog post um below so you can see it but I had this print put on from my reupholster this came from Calico Corners here in my city and I love the print it's so gorgeous I really I've thought about putting that print on my chairs but we'll see how that goes I did want to quickly mention that this um, this Sheen Wiserine portrait from the at-home store I'm thinking about taking it down and getting some antique plates to put up there um, I'll insert a video of something that I saw recently that inspired this thought. So I'm really thinking about changing those to plates. We are now in my home office upstairs in the loft. And you guys already know about this. This is my green settee or little love seat. I found this on, well, it was Facebook Marketplace, but I actually ended up going to pick it up at an antique store or a rental place. But I love this piece. It's a beautiful sage green color with the brown trim and I added my pillows to it and a little pillow roll and a blanket. I have my um, sage green little bench here. This is where I have my morning Bible study. So I come in here and it's so peaceful and I just love it. This I paid $175 for on Facebook Marketplace and I thought that was a steal. It does have two matching chairs but I really don't like those too much, so I think I'm just going to stick with the settee. You all know about my bookshelf. So, um, this is actually loaded with stuff now. <laughs> I bought this a few months ago from Facebook Marketplace. I wanted my own little bookcase for my favorite books and my decor. So, um, that's the Caroline Rome book giant book that I just got that I haven't had a chance to dive into yet but it, it houses all my favorite books some of my favorite knickknacks and antiques and I love this bookcase I paid 140 for it I think 150 and it has these beautiful um rose canton ginger jars that I got um, from an antique store and this tobacco leaf ginger jar that I also got online from Pinder and Peony over here is my little, um, now I'm growing them. <laughs> it's kind of a fog right now. Um, right here's my little divider that I got from Facebook Marketplace. Um, I didn't pay much for this either. I can't remember what I paid for. No, I paid a, probably a little over a hundred for it, not much, but it has a beautiful sage green color as well and hand painted mural that has a little bit of the chinoiserie feel. It's beautiful. This green is pretty close to the sage green on my settee. And I love that. 
they actually flow pretty well. So we have the boutique over here. I'm not going to show you that. It's a little bit messy over there because I'm going through inventory and taking a look at everything. But this is my desk area. This is also from the at-home store. That's the green version of the blue version downstairs. And yeah, those are my beautiful Facebook Marketplace finds in my office. This is the next Facebook Marketplace find. This was actually at my desk in my office, but it was just a little too low for it. So I'm still on the hunt for a new chair for my desk. But I moved this to our bedroom and my husband loves this chair in here. <laughs> he talks about how comfortable it is. He comes in in the evenings, takes off his shoes, starts to undress. He gets, he gets ready at this chair in the morning. He loves it. So that actually worked out great. And I'm so happy that he actually uses it and enjoys it. So we are now in my walk-in closet. Um, I just got this rug from TJ Maxx. This is my recent, the most recent Facebook Marketplace purchase, and I paid $50 for this chair, and I couldn't pass it up. I, don't, I didn't have anywhere to put it, but there was no way, no way that I was going to leave this sitting on Facebook Marketplace for $50, no way. The caning is perfect. There's nothing wrong with it. There's no damage. There, You will see a little bit of fading right here in the front. So I will have to have it reupholstered. I'm so torn because I put it on the Grand Millennial Facebook page and everyone's just like, don't change the stripes, keep the stripes. But if I can't find the stripes, I may do a chinoiserie, I'm not sure. Um, I, have a, I had a coworker who I showed the photo to and she said, do the sage green stripes if you can't find the pink. So I'll keep that in mind. I'm It's going to be a minute before I get it reupholstered because, again, it's going to be very expensive. But um, I had it in my office and I just thought, now, you know, I'll move it to my closet. And I love having it in here. It is a little tight, but I love having this little chair in, in here. So I can put my scarves on it. Um, and you will see this beautiful scarf online here soon. This has not launched. This is not my scarf. I wish it was, but it's gorgeous. It's from Sarah Flint, but it hasn't been, it hasn't launched yet. So I was actually able to get it a little bit earlier. And so I also put my purse on here with my other scarves. And I absolutely love using this as a landing place. You guys will see the vintage hook that I have up there if you follow me on LTK. So I love it. I think it's great. My husband just keeps calling me crazy for buying all these chairs, but I love my little Facebook Marketplace finds. So I think it's a great little addition here in my closet. I got the rug and oh, so I'm starting to add plates in here. Yeah, so that's one of my Johan Hovland. I think I'm saying it right. If I'm butchering it, I'm sorry, but I think I'm going to start adding plates here to my closet wall and I've got a little space over here too but I thought that would be so grand I think I love it every time I come into my closet and see the plate and my rug and chair just makes me happy but I'll give you guys a little look at my closet it's it's a walk-in closet it's a little tight you know because I have this um this organizational set in here but I love this this actually keeps everything in order and it just, it's, I love it. I love how everything has been reorganized and has made me so happy. <laughs> so, yeah, and in here I have my travel stuff here and here. Now I can see everything. And down here I have my belts and other little things and my sunglasses. So, but that is it of my Facebook Marketplace finds. So I hope you enjoyed my video sharing my Facebook Marketplace finds get on there and do a search. I mean, give it a try. You'll be amazed at what you find and be a little open to it. And I would say be bold, <laughs> be bold in asking for a discount. Just, just be a little bold. Some people will tell you no, and that's okay. That's okay. Like with my, um, my cane chair that's upstairs in my closet with the stripes on it. I knew I wasn't getting a discount on that. I, I knew it. I knew it was already priced. Well, sometimes you just know, and you're just like, I'm just going to go ahead and pay it. That's okay. Before I end my video, um, I don't know if any of you are Bath and Body Works fans. I know I am somewhat. You know, now that I'm getting older, I'm just like, mm. some of it I love, some of it I don't. I'm half and half now, but 
they have their Bridgerton line. I don't know if any of you have heard of it or you get the emails, but the Brightest Bloom has just launched in stores and on the website, and I love it. If you are a floral person, this is so great. It smells just like a garden. It really does. It's so good, and I have the body whip butter. So I got the email right when it launched, and at that time, they were $5.95 for each little you know, for the cream and for the body whip and for the body spray. So I went right to the store and grabbed a couple. So I'm not sure if that still is still going on, but check out the brightest bloom. You have to love florals in order to enjoy that scent. If you are not a floral person and floral scents give you headaches, don't bother. Just leave it alone and don't ruin it for us who love floral scents because there are some of us like me who love floral scents and just like, just if you don't like it, okay, fine, go away. <laughs> and we love it. Leave us alone. Let us enjoy. So that that's a new um, purchase. And I'm, I probably should not be sharing this, but it's so gorgeous. I just, I don't know. <laughs> it's just, it's beautiful. So I'm just going to give you a sneak peek. That is a silk scarf. It is not mine. I wish it was. But that should be launching here very soon with Sarah Flint. <laughs> so that's all I'm going to say. It is stunning. I have been wearing it for a week straight. I just, oh my gosh, <laughs> I love it so much. Oh, and along with the toile plate that I found at the Goodwill, I found this for $15 as well. It's unbelievable. This huge, and I mean, it's huge. This huge ginger jar. Let me put the lid on it. It's a beautiful mauve color. Now, I don't know if someone hand painted this to change the color, but isn't that gorgeous? I found it yesterday for $14.99. I put it in my closet next to my cane chair. It's beautiful. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoy my Facebook Marketplace finds. Like I said, I'll update you on any home decor switch-ups I may do. I am working on putting together a, a canopy above my bed. So I'm actually on the hunt for vintage fabrics, curtains, and a valance because I saw it done at the show house and I think I can do it here. And I've always wanted a beautiful canopy, can canopy above my bed. So wish me luck. If I get it done, of course, I'll share it here on YouTube and the blog. So thanks for watching and I will link everything below that I can and we'll chat soon. Bye.